So let me start by being extremely clear. I am 100% committed to the mission of NASA and its future. Nobody is more committed to manned spaceflight, to human exploration of space, than I am. But we've got to do it in a smart way. And we, and we can't just keep on doing the same old things that we've been doing and thinking that somehow is going to get us to where we want to go. Bold new era of space exploration. An era not focused on the next destination, but focused on investments in technology and innovation, that focused on the capabilities required for us to be a space-faring society. We'll start by sending astronauts to an asteroid for the first time in history. By the mid-2030s, I believe we can send humans to orbit Mars and return them safely to Earth. And a landing on Mars will follow. And I expect to be around to see it. But I want to repeat, I want to repeat this. Critical to deep space exploration will be the development of breakthrough propulsion systems and other advanced technologies. We will spend the next 10 years recreating capabilities that this nation once had and, uh, and threw away. Why are we doing this? Um, because with the technology anyone can foresee for the next generation or two, uh, spaceflight is expensive, difficult, and dangerous, and if you're going to do it, the goals ought to be worthy of the costs and the risks. We are at some sort of turning point. Everybody's looking at China and saying, if, if we don't lift our game, China is going to eat our lunch economically because the amount that they are investing in science, technology, and innovation, while it has not yet reached anything like our level, is rising very quickly. They're doing extraordinary things. Uh, anybody who's been to China lately, who's been to Shanghai, who's been to Beijing, you look around and you see the energy and the investment. People are looking and they're saying, you know, it's not automatic that the United States will be, will be number one in science and technology and innovation. This is something that has to be cultivated, it has to be invested in, um, and uh, the President has been very clear. He wants to see us out-innovate, out-educate, and out-build the competition.